Hey there guys, it's Johnny. Hey, I just wanted to do a, a quick video on the beginning uh, string names and intervals for um, the foundation of our guitar lessons that we've been working on together. Uh, so just to kind of walk us through really quickly in case you need to be able to come back and reinforce this. The strings uh, from the top down starting on the sixth string is our E, our low E, that's number six. And then our fifth string is the A. And uh, then our fourth string is the D. Our third string is the G. And then our fifth string, excuse me, our second string is the B. And our first string is the E. So the string names are E, A, D, G, E, E. And I always like to use every athlete does good body exercises. That's how I remember the string names. You can remember it any way you'd like. Um, differently than the every good boy does fine thing, which is more musical and note based. This is just to remember the strings. Every athlete does good body exercises. And then when it comes to the intervals of the notes on the neck, we start at the zero fret, which is our bridge. And when we play that first note on the sixth string, it is the open E. Uh, and the way the intervals work is they're constant and they either are a step or in a couple of cases a half step. So if we were to go from the E to the F, it's a half step up to the first fret. So E is open, F is that first fret, and then to come to the G, we move up a full step two, and then to the A on the fifth fret, to the B on the seventh, and up a half to the C on the eighth fret, and then to the D, on the 10th fret, and finally back to the E on the 12th fret. The 12th fret is the two dot fret, as you can see here. And so open, E, 12th fret, E. So the interval on the E string, number six, is E, F, G, A, B, C, D, and then back to E on that 12th two dot fret. On the A string, open A is our zero. And so to the B, we go up a full step, two frets to the second. That's B. Up a half to the C. And you'll notice that's the note for our C chord. Up a full to the D, which is the fifth fret. Up to the E, which is the seventh fret. Half, one fret up to the F, which is the eighth. And then up two to the G. And then at the 12th fret, back to the A again. So open on the 5th string, A, and then on the 12th, A. So that's the interval, and on the A, it's A, B, C, D, E, F, G, and then back to the A. Then one more, we'll throw the D string in. You don't use it as much as we build the foundation, but just to hone it in there. The open 4th uh, string is the D note. So to the E, we're going to come up 2. F, we're going to come up 1. So there's our F on the 3rd fret on that D string. The G is the 5th fret. Back to the A, which is the 7th fret. The B, which is the 9th fret. The C, which is the 10th fret. And then back to the D, which is the 12th 2 dot fret. So open, D, 12th fret. Those are your intervals. And so all together on the D, it's D, E, F, G, A, B, C, and D. So there you are. There's your beginning foundation uh, to make sure that you've got uh, the right string names in your head and the right intervals on the fretboard. Thanks a lot. Let me know if you have any questions.